Yo, what's up guys? Today I'm doing a tutorial on QuakeCraft. If you don't know this game is, or this plugin is, go ahead and check out that server on the screen. Play a couple games. This minigame is really cool, so you guys should definitely download this plugin. Once you have that plugin, you also need another plugin, which will be called World Edit. Most of you will probably have that already, but if you don't, that will be in the description too. So go ahead and download and put those in your plugins folder, start your server up and we'll go ahead and get started so make sure you have a lobby of any size in any world really and make sure you have a lobby wall so basically just blank signs going across doesn't matter what size this is where world edit will come in so we'll need our wand tool type slash slash wand go ahead and left click to select your first corner and then right click to select your second then type slash Quake add lobby. And there we go. Our lobby one has been created. Now we're going to set the point where all the players go to once the game is over. So anywhere inside your lobby slash quake set lobby spawn. So now all the players once the game is over will spawn right here. Now the last command is slash quake save lobby. Alright, once your lobby has been saved, we're going to create our arena, slash quake, create, and then the name of your arena. For this tutorial, I'm just going to call it test, but call it anything you want. Once you're done with that, do slash quake your arena name, and then set min. This would be the minimum amount of players in your games. So, three is going to be my minimum amount. You're going to do the same thing except set your max players. So my max will be 10. Hit enter. Now type slash quake your arena name. So mine is called test set map. This will be the name of your map pretty much. So I'm just going to call mine ruins. Then hit enter. Now you're going to add your spawn. So go over to your arena. And you'll notice that your arena has been displayed on your signs there. That's pretty cool. And you add your spawns by typing slash quake your arena name and then add spawn you can type that same command in and keep adding spawns so just keep typing your same command add as many spawns as you want I'm just gonna stop there once you're done type slash quake your arena name and then save then there you go that you're done you are completely done You've just added your arena, and your arena is ready to play. So you can keep adding as many arenas as you want, and it's so easy. Alright, so if you like this video, go ahead and like it and subscribe. Go ahead and check out my other minigame plugin tutorials. And yeah, peace out, guys.